Welcome to my channel. Not done a live one for a while. Been doing other things. And um, we're back with Eve. As you can see, we are going to do the storyline that's been offered. Uh, but we do have to go to this system. In fact, I'm just going to just set Destiny. Just so I know which station it is. Uh, so I may as well jump into the busted that has has a 50 well for me it's 57,000 m3 um excuse me m3 fleet hanger which is just awesome uh, you can just throw anything in it and this mission is about picking up and dropping off and it's seven and a half thousand m3 so yeah so let's let's go to the storyline agent always do your storylines guys no matter what it is it makes a massive difference to your standings uh, and everything so i would just do them as part of the course because uh, it's yeah it's it's a must okay so Let's go to Ekyo in the big fat slow bustard. Obviously you can see the hull, it's based on the badger hull. But this is, it's a nice ship for hauling. I used to use these and the crane. Uh, the crane is a is a is a cloaky warpy transport ship uh, this one is a blockade runner if you look at the fit of nothing on the top but if you look at the reason resists I put these on look at those resists on the shield amazing that's uh, a tough Tough ship. Fifty-four thousand EHP. Sweet. Okay. Thank you. Drive active. Where do I have to pick him up? Pick up from there and drop off at there. Yeah, I've done this one before. In fact, I'll set that destination now. There you go, so it's five jumps away. And for that, you don't get a huge amount. It's not about the money with this. Like I said, it's a storyline agent and it's effective standards if you have a look. 9.2. And you just it well. I don't know if you want to read all that. You can just pause, guys, if you want to read it. Okay. And it is this one. Warp drive active. Anyway, I hope you're well. It's a Thursday. The weekend's nearly here. Don't know what everyone's doing. I just love the sun to come out. I can get out on the motorbike now. Not used it that much this year. No, well, it's just my, it's just the way I've have been health wise so uh, just when I feel okay I'll get out Docking permission requested. come on let's push it forward Docking there request you go accepted. Uh, 
accept. Thank you. Let's let's get the stuff. There they are. We'll put them in the fleet hanger. When you get to the other end, you will have to take them out of the fleet hanger, put them in your item hanger, or else, or else they won't find them. They don't go searching your ship. If it was in the cargo hold, yeah, not a problem. But for some reason, the fleet hanger is the fleet hanger, and they don't look in there. Silly billies. Right, let's burn four jumps. <clears throat> Just take a while to get to uh, to get to walk. As you can imagine, it is a lump. They're not bad. I mean, you can see these here. These, are, this is the. Uh, I love how they go into detail with things like this. This is your storage compartments. All these. Love it. The detail is something that's that's a lidar. It's made by lidar. You can see that just there. Look, lidar. Um, I just love how they go uh, into details. Even the BU for busted. You know, it's just one thing this game always did was just blow me away with 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 detail I think that's my old CD coming in but anyone else uh, feel the same let me know and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe guys if you do like what you see um, I know some people will be bored stiff with this but this really isn't aimed at it's not really aimed at people who have years and years experience this is more for the people who are maybe a year or so into the game haven't quite found all the all the uh, bits to do uh, looking for guidance looking for a direction to go in I mean there is so many directions you can go in um, yeah but at the end of the day I mean, everyone's obviously welcome to watch and uh, and comment, but you know, positive stuff, guys. No, I've had one negative one, which I removed. I mean, why? Why would you even? I can't believe people actually come to the keyboard, go out of their way, and put something derogatory or or negative on. Why? Is your life so shallow and meaningless that you have to excite? yourself with typing things like what they typed anyway it's been removed so no one's seen it that's fine i mean i know this is not the best way to do things as far as earning money yeah you can live in zero zero null sec and you can earn a lot more but this is empire and this is how it's done there are other options in empire I'm just doing what what I used to doing. Um, no griefing. You know, in the old days, people used to come in and do your mission. Not do your missions. They'd come into your mission, they'd scan you down, come into your mission, and Nick say something you uh, you were supposed to collect from a can. They'd steal it and warp off so you couldn't finish the mission. Things like that, which were just ridiculous. But and they still do it. Yeah, still do it, but I'll just crack on. You know, even if, if I lose a ship, who cares? Who cares? It's only a game. Anyway, that's my rant over. <laughs> and we are nearly there. By the way, anybody who wants to do level 4 missions, I'm quite willing to take you in fleet with me. So you get, if you're not doing level 4s, uh, you haven't got the standing for level 4s, you can fleet it with me and obviously I'll share the rewards and the standings with you. When you're in fleet, you can do that. Uh, it does speed things up a bit and before you know it, you're doing your own level 4s.
it's a good way to uh, to do it and it's a great way to stay in shape <laughs> sorry private joke <laughs> anybody who's seen family guy know what i'm on about Come on. And to the station we go. Is anyone in here? So that's pretty good. <clears throat> so you can fit things like a mi micro jump drive here, medium micro jump drive. I have used the ship in 00 nullsec and I have got through. Um, gate camps. Sounds silly, but I have. Especially with the crane, I've done the. I've lost, lost the crane as well with an awful lot of um, stuff in it. But majority of the time, I get through. Wow, control tower. It's not something you see all the all. All the time now. That's a Don't control tower. Is a a player-owned station, a POS. Okay, let's. Like I said, we need to drag that out from the fleet hangar and drag it into the item. What have I got? No, oh, it's just. Yeah. Right. So now we can complete that. There you go. Standings pretty decent. So we'll go back to a mocha, we'll do some level fours. I think we might do them in the gealer again. I've not had time to get the navy uh Raven, and I don't know if I, I might get the Scorpion instead. Shall we have a look at this? Um, this pos. Let's have a look at the pos for those who don't know what a pos is. Uh, we used to live in these before citadels and keep stars and everything else. Um. This is this this was how you lived in Nullsec. You lived in a pos. Right, so it's offline. Well there's no bubble, so it's not it's not it's anchored. Uh, I wonder if I could unanchor that. Should we have a go? I can certainly fit in the uh, busted. Let's have a look. been so long normally you will have a, a a huge bubble force field around this if it was online obviously it's been allowed to go offline um i don't know don't know as far as it's anchored so i don't know if i can unanchor it No, I don't think you can now. Oh, that's a shame. It's a, it's only a Caldera control tower. It's not faction or anything, so it's not worth a huge amount of money. But anyway, that's a control tower, and like I say, normally it'd be a huge force field bubble right around it encapsulating all the tower and modules and extra bits that uh, 
that people need like um like uh, storage facilities for ships things like that uh, and of course it would have defense systems as well you know scram arrays um it would have i don't know lasers or blaster arrays you know but um those are the good old days spent many a day bringing down a pos or putting it into uh reinforce mode let's just set destiny uh shall i pick these up while i'm on my way yes i think i will what else have i got in may as well pick these this up do i really want the incursors no so a sober second yeah i'll pick those up as well oh god yeah i'll pick that up as well Yeah, so what you've got in yellow there. So if you've set uh, a destination, the systems in yellow are the systems you're going to pass through to get to that destination. So if you've got things there, I always look. If I've got anything there, I always try and keep my uh, inventory clean, tidy, but <laughs> my intentions are good. Let's put it that way. Okay. So the Seki. Oh, yeah. So I've got that. I, I remember I bought those the other day for the Gila. So I may as well get those. If you remember the hammer, the hammerheads are they thermal? Yeah, thermal. Okay. <coughs> yeah, if I've got anything expensive, I'm going to take to Jita. I mean, very expensive. I'll use the busted. Small amount, but very expensive. You know, I will take the busted. As uh, people will try and attack you. Right, let's dock. And of course, there's no way they'll insta pop uh, a busted on the gates. Have to be a quite a big fleet, and they will have to, and they will all have to alpha strike you all at the same time, which doesn't happen that often, unless they're on a planned op, of course. But you've just got there's one guy in G2 who's just there constantly ganking. It has been said that he is using um, some sort of software third-party software to uh, to collect the um, the goods after he's killed someone to collect the wreck but it's well I say it's not been proved Docking permission requested. looking at some of the guys who are talking about it I think I think they've got a case but apparently uh, CCP don't want to know Hey -ho. I think some of, some of you guys watching might know who it is. I watched him the other day. He's always in a tornado. 
Uh, I was. What, I don't know if you guys caught any of my broadcast just jitter live. Tell me what you think about that. If I mean, if you think anything, um, it's just something I thought I'd do, just to, just to, uh, well, just to see see what response I got. I think it's. Um, I'm, I was trying to do it on the other system on the laptop, but it won't. It won't run smoothly because it does time. The only thing is, it ties me down, so I can't do anything else with the computer. Right, Kakakella. I might as well pick those up. Are you ready? Come on, big boy. It's so slow. What? Have I named this? Yeah, I have. There you go. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. can pick those up. Warp drive active. To walk we go. Fast I think it's three AUs. <clears throat> it's about as fast as they go. Let's have a look. Three three point three AUs. Obviously you can hand sat slightly with rigs and things. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Let's throw him in. Uh, don't think it'll go in anyway. Oh, it does. Fair enough. Probably never use it. Okay, to warp again. <clears throat> I know it's a bit early for a live broadcast today, but... Uh, I've got other things to do later. I thought I'd um, do a recording now.
Okay. A mocha. Stock up. See what mission she'll offer us. Be nice to get an omic team, wouldn't it? And I will get the. Now I've got the loyalty points. I've six hundred and fourteen thousand loyalty points. So uh, I'll have a look at next the next ship, and we'll fit it out. We'll do some missions in that. Okay. So that was the storyline. Very important. Whenever you're offered one, do it, guys. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Okay. So let's swap out, and it's oh, we'll put those. We put those in the gila. I think we're gonna do the gila, aren't we? Was doing in there. <laughs> oh god. I think that's full there, yeah, the drone base full, so I've got all those. Uh let's have a look. Hmm. I'll leave those as they are. These can stay back. Right, I'm just gonna be I'll be right back guys. I've just got something I need to do. Okay, welcome back. Right, let's let's see what she's oh she's offered me something. Oh, it's enemies abound. I never finished it, did I? Okay, we're gonna have to accept that. And it's Galenti Federation. It's in a mock up. Enemies abound. Well, let's let's accept that. Oh god, I didn't uh So enemies abound oh. Enemies abound Part one, part two, part three. We're on part four now. Uh, kinetic and thermal doesn't really ap apply to us because we're using the Gila and it's a drone boat and we're sniping. So I will just use, with the kinetic, I will use the Caldari Navy uh, Vespers. Okay, so we've got Scrammers, <coughs> five of them. Scrammers and Webbers. So it's again, it's just a matter of just, just removing them. <clears throat> removing the little ones from the field and these are the insignia you get from that and I'll I'll reiterate guys if you got a salvager use them because these are worth quite a bit of money on the uh, 
open market. And that's five, but we've yet to do that. Okay. So. So we've accepted it. We're good to go. And we'll... Why are my personal assets down there? We'll put that there. Undock. <clears throat> So, like before, keeping your eye on your drones, making sure that they are always moving as best you can. Because if they sit still, they'll be shot and killed. So we've got enough Vespers. Two sets of Vespers. Okay, so we will go in. Warp drive active. Have a look around. See where, see who's where, and burn away from them all. So there they are. There's going to be more spawns, methinks. So I am going to go this way. I'm going to remove those from there okay let me drop the vespers and let's lock up these lights and let's put them on them straight away don't think I can lock any more up One down. Sweet. Come on, boys. Wipe these pesky little ones out. So we do have a gate there, but um, right now I'll just focus on the little ones because they are on to the drones. You can see the little buggers are on that uh, they're on that drone. So as soon as we've taken those out. Come on, boys, they're struggling with this one. They can split up now and again, so just make sure you press an F, the F key. Select your target, press F, and that sends the drones to that target. Damage is minimal now. I'm going to orbit the gate at this. They're taking the time with that. Oh, finally. He's getting a bit of damage. One of the drones you can see is getting a bit of damage. That should disappear. It should be, it should be okay. We've got two more, three more to kill. They seem to be struggling. Oh, no, they're not. Just took the time getting there. Right, next one. And finally, the last one. So the damage on that drone is now dissipating. He's, re he's, he's regening his shield. So we start on the big boys now.
and you can see the DPS from the drones pretty decent come on boys Copy Pella. I'm just thinking if I should use hmm. taking too long, let's bring him in. Should be a lot quicker than that, obviously, yeah. It says kinetic and thermal, but I'm going to use the uh, hammerheads. Let's see what that does. When these two are finally in. Right, let's try the hammerheads. Right, let's see what we get with those better that's a lot better that's one thing to remember I know on the guide it says kinetic and thermal but I'd use thermal damage as your primary And the last one. It's just going to go pop. And they're ripping through this one, straight through his shields. I know it's an armor tanker, but that shouldn't last long either. Damage is rear end. <coughs> towards the gate that overheat slightly and he go boom Megathron not one of my favorite battleships but uh, they're good they're dangerous in the right hands with the right, with the right fit Let's get to the gate. Obviously, I'll edit this out in the edited version. Right, the drones are in. Just repair that. Hey, Chris, you all right? Uh, 100mn uh, yeah on the on the Megatron you, I think you can I'm not I've never really been a massive fan of the Megatron um, I'd have to look at a fit on that um, yeah I mean obviously it's a battleship so yeah But it would be a case of just just playing around with the fit on the fitting. I mean, you've got now. You have a fitting tool. You have the fitting screen here now, and you can you can go to simulation. We never used to have that in the old days. So you used to have to just mess about. I mean, when I first started, you literally just had to buy the thing and hope it fitted. Right, let's go. Warp drive active. Yeah, Megathron looks, it looks evil, but mine, 
No. It's, it's, I like my Mimitar. I don't know why, but I do like the Mimitar. And uh, let's just have a look at this. Oh, it's this one here. Okay, let's burn down. Let's burn down. Right, let's drop the hammerheads again. Well, may as well put them on these two. I think we'll have a spawn of little ones as well. Yeah, there is a bit of a delay, Chris, on me seeing your... Well, you hearing me. I see your chat straight away, but uh, there's a bit of a delay on you hearing me. I've tried to reduce it as much as I can, but it seems to be... Seems to be the norm. Anyway, how are you doing with the with your missions? And what are you? Did you have the? I think you had the tango, didn't you? The tango you fitted the tango out. Come on. I'm going to open the gate now, as it is. The Dominics. You see, I don't mind the Domi. It's a quite a bulbous big thing, but I do like it when I'm using uh, sentry drones. I prefer the Dominics to the Megathron. I did actually start flying Galenta ships when I uh, when I first started playing, which was a long time ago. There goes the Domi. Okay, let's keep those drones busy. another I mean they don't look too bad they're quite an evil looking uh, ship quite menacing it's just with with megathrons it's just in the old days it's just blasters and they've got to be right up close and personal to do any any serious damage I mean there are other other fates um, but the main thing is, I think it's, I think it's projectile, a bonus to those. Right, let's uh, look at the dummies. They're not doing much. And there's a pos. The Galentipos. Okay, another dummy. Well, they don't last long. <laughs> Federation Navy Dummy. <clears throat> and the final one. <laughs> I 
Right, I'm just gonna burn to the gate. Moving around in my chair, just trying to get comfortable, which is not very easy nowadays. Okay, last one. Let's pull these boys in. Wave goodbye to the Megathron. Let's take the gate. So I don't know if you've tried the Tengu uh, fit, Chris. I don't know if you've um, if you've managed to get it get it right with with a few implants. Those implants are literally are just damage uh, and range. I've no other implants other than the plus fours. Is they're, they're only there for really for the skill training speed. So there's I've not actually got like snake implants and things like that. I never really bothered with those. Not for not for things like this. Don't get me wrong, when we were in Nullsec, yeah. You know, you need to enhance your your damage or your speed or whatever even more in, in Nullsec. That does help. Immensely. I'm not going to repair it. I was going to repair that then, but let's just see where we are. Oh, sentry guns and little ones. What a surprise. These are painful. Right, so I need to get out quick. These need to die very quickly. more I'm going to uh, overheat because this really does matter now all the little ones need to die very quickly guys because this is going to be quite tight He's getting some damage, that drone. I'm getting some damage. Might lose a drone here. Gonna repair these while I can. Ah, lost a drone. Son of a... To, uh, we have to launch them. My God, they're still hitting me. Blimey. Right, let's go for transversal. Come on, guys. Still getting damage here. Okay, I'm going to have to call it. I'm just going to warp anywhere. When these two finally come in. I've got no little ones on me, which is good, because you are in danger of losing. Oh, it's going to die. It's very slow, and it's gone. Okay. That wasn't good. That was not good. Prepare that. Obviously, you can dock up and your shield, when you undock your shield's fine. 
but um, let's just repair everything and we can walk to this one good job I can edit this out <laughs> So we lost both hammerheads there. I'm not going to drop them this time until, until I get to a distance. And the trouble is when you warp out of a mission, you have to go through all the gates to get to where you left, which is painful. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. So, the infiltrators are the um, Let's just see what the mission says on that. Um, let's get some more drones. Where are they? On my heads. I could just get. I'm going to remove some of the. Um... I'm going to remove these. Let's just put the hammerheads in. Republic fleet. Okay. Right, let's go back to it. So a lot more hammerheads this time. And we are going to go back to mission, but we have to go through all the flipping gates, bounce through all the gates we've done to get to where we left off. It's just a shame you can't put a micro jump drive on uh, on the keeler. <laughs> that would be something. Okay, let's go, let's go. Warp drive active. Sometimes I I don't finish in the ship I started with, but uh, I do like to try and finish start and finish with the ship I started with. It does depend on the mission of course. This is a little tough at the end. Come on. Warp drive active. And the next one. At least it warps you in kind of close to the gaze. Some of the missions just warp you in on the gate, so you literally can just pew pew straight through. Come on. So I'm not going to drop the drones till I burn. Burn away. There we go. And there they are. So it's literally a 180. As quick as you can. Because they'll be out to get you. And 
left his launch because there's some little ones close and those stinking sentry guns are the problem. We'll try and get rid of those sentry guns because they really are a, a massive headache. close by so I'm going to leave those right now concentrate on the sentry guns I'm going to knock that off nice one and the DPS is falling now like I'm getting a delivery from Amazon today. There we go. Right. I'm going to orbit now. I think we're far enough away. Let's get our uh, transversal up. Going to watch those drones. Sweet. Don't think oh, I should have left them on them. I don't think we'll have much trouble from the lights now. Main thing, the damage is the uh, the damage is, is the sentry guns. Did quite a bit of damage to that. Come on, boys, blimey. Taking your time. Just going to keep pressing F just to remind them where they're going. And sometimes they are. Oh my god, am I losing another one? Son of a... That's a tough one to kill. Blimey, they are... Sorry if you can hear my missus in the background, guys. I've just lost the drill. Uh, let's drop another one. <clears throat> and send him to that one. Finally! Jeez, that took some bloody doing. This is the final room, though, so you do expect it to that bit a little bit tougher right let's try and uh, kill these mother truckers flipping egg it cost me two drones <laughs> don't like losing drones and I very rarely do but today well that died a lot quicker than the last one already dead good oh my god why why didn't the other one pop like that god damn it <laughs> you horrible little man ok 
Okay, let's go for the big boys. Right, well, you know we're not going to lose any drones to the big ones, so that's good. I mean, how much of those... How much of those? So, so I'll... Eh, there you go, 1.8 million. A noon and, jeez, it's a blast from the past. We used to go through a noon and. That was like the uh, bottom of a pipe. I'm trying to remember where from. Jesus. But Anuna was the station. My God. I'm going to knock this off and repair it. Go on, boys. doing too much damage take a while to repair that and the drones are doing pretty good job we'll get this one he's a bit close so he's doing a bit of damage now get the boys on him dead any second now. Look at all the damage on his rear end. Bye bye. Yeah. Final one. Shouldn't get any more damage now. So, hammerheads for this one, guys. And that should be done. Ah, we're going to destroy the shipyard as well. I remember now. Okay. Let's mm, damage wise. Let's have a look at this. Take a while. They're doing the damage, but my God. <laughs> Flipping egg. That's going to take a while. Sorry guys, I wish I could fast forward through this. Halfway through. I 
I do like a good explosion at the end of it. Mm. I wonder if this shows damage. Oh, it's a shame it doesn't. Just looking where they're hitting. Uh, that'd be cool, wouldn't it? The stations show damage near or like the ships do. through its shields let's see what its armor's like already into the armor Okay, we're going quicker, a lot quicker through the armor. Yeah. Okay, nearly halfway already. That's good. Keep it up, boys. I hope the structure's uh, pretty weak. <laughs> cool. Let's have a look, see if I can look at. Uh, my little drone. There he is. I love how I can shoot at 90 degrees. <laughs> Look at him, tough little nut. Gotta love these uh, faction drones. They do. They do take some. Da uh, they do take some damage. Oh, uh, well, let's have a look at the structure. Ah, okay. It's gonna go quick. It's gonna go quick. Ish. Oh, it does. I was just looking then. Yeah, it does. See where is the damage is. See if we can see the next. There. There's the, dam there's the damage. I never knew that. Now you see, you learn something new every day. It actually shows it like the ships. That's good. That's really good. My missus can talk loud on the phone. Jesus. Hope you're not picking up, guys. Sorry if you are. Here we go. Here you go, big bada boom. There we go. Let's call these bad boys home. Should be, thank you. Objective complete, four or five. Okay, come on, we're going. Sweet, so that was that one. 
while we're warping let's just have a quick look at the next final one part five explosive and kinetic and it's Mimitar Republic so it is explosive <clears throat> and what we got well, a couple of um, webbies but no scrams so that's okay that's good let's dock up docking permission requested docking request accepted I don't know if you guys um, have an insta dock um, that's just habit for me when I was in zero zero you, had, you always made sure you had a, an insta dock rather than just walk to the station and then and then dock because it can be the difference between life and death so if you it's up to you if uh, you're ever out there in the wildlands make sure you do your insta docks okay so request mission let's Enemy is a bell, 5 of 5. Mimita next door. Ah, uh, that's 8,600, so it's not going to be an easy one. And what she wants us to do, just. Destroy the smuggler. Right, destroy the smuggler gate as soon as possible, right? Well, that's going to be pretty well guarded. Right, okay, so the gate is the target. Accept it. Let's have a look at our drones first. So it's next door. Isn't it? So the drones, we need some explosive drones. Uh, that's going to be the uh, Valkyrie Fleet Republic. There you are. So I need to swap out. We'll swap out these. Oh, you numpty. Right, so what space have we got? No, no space. So that's. They're what we're going to use. Let's go. Right, I'm going to rep these while uh, I remember. I mean, it's not imperative, but I just like things to be in order. That's my OCD coming through. Okay. I don't know what you think to the gear, guys. Um, I don't know what you think to the drone boat of a gila rather than uh up close and personal but to me you can never really get that dps from the ship itself it's all it's all the drones so for me it makes sense to uh to attack from from a distance you know just let the drones do the work yeah you're gonna lose some drones who cares they're only about 1.8 million each big deal it's about the fun. I've been having fun in E for years. I had a bit of a break. I think I had about a three year break. Um, Cause I've done a lot. Oh, I was spending too much time. You've got to regulate your time properly guys. Cause I was doing silly hours. My missus, I don't know my missus stayed with me. Cause I was, um, I was on it as soon as we got home, and I was on it till like the early hours of the morning. And that was nearly every day, relentless, and it just, I realized that's too much. Oh, come on, big boy, you're clear now. Let's get that boost to go in. Ah. <sighs> 
finally. Well, we're going straight down. And we've got bloody sentries. Straight away those things hit you. So we're going to take them out. And we're going to overheat. That one. Okay, the damage isn't so much, but even just taking that one out makes a difference. Let's get the stabber. Keep your drones on the move. Watch your damage on your ship. Take out the mediums. Okay, I'm gonna before I burn out my module, I'm gonna turn it off. <laughs> turn over heat off okay we're getting a distance now keep the drones moving so we need to destroy that as well we get a little bit more distance my favourite ships. Right, let's do the stabbers. Typhoons. <laughs> let's do some repair while we're here. is sort of kind of in the middle of them all where's the stabber it's taking a bit of a pounding so we've got a tempest and a typhoon to kill after the stabber's gone Let's do the Typhoon. No, let's do the Tempest. Uh, as soon as he dies, I'm going to head towards the Smuggler's Gate. Do like the Tempest. Anybody who watched or has seen um, the the movie, the Eve movie, made by obviously people who play the game, Blue Skies. No, Blue Skies, Clear Skies. Oh, we got some little ones. Um, I was actually in the first one. Uh, we were the st I'm in the stunt team. You see in the credits, you'll see Fuzzy TBE in the in the credits of Clear Skies, the first one. That was awesome. We were fit they were filming all night, and we were in the fight scene. If you look at it, if you look at it, there's the Galenti versus the Amarian. I was in a um, 
fleets and I was in the uh, Abaddon and you can see the Abaddon dropping down and going in front of everyone that was me um, yeah claim to fame guys have a look at it it's a bit it's a bit of an old film now and there's clear skies 2 as well but the first one I was in and I was uh, just loving every minute of it I'd only been playing the game in maybe a year and uh, the guy saying oh they need they need people for uh, for filming and they'd asked our corp to supply pilots brilliant I was in the job then uh, the job and we were part of the fatal alliance where Sister Bliss came from. Oh, that, or should I say that's where I knew Sister Bliss, who's Mr. Initiative. Well, not so much now, but uh, in the good old days, Sister Bliss used to FC everything. I mean, everything. They spent a lot of time a lot of effort. Always appreciate this time and effort. Big respect for you, Sister Bliss. And of course, now we have Dark Shines at the helm. And Dark Shines is just as good. Cap a very capable FC. Uh, immense respect from all, all the pilots, all the members in the Alliance. You know, they, they, we all follow him implicitly. He's, he's one of those guys who has that, um, has that, I won't say air, but that respect. Really? Was I already looking at that ship? My God. I am looking at it, just don't know why it's delayed. Okay, that, oh no, we're going to do the smuggler thing now, aren't we? Oh, let's go to the gate. Bring those two in. Oh no, don't, no, don't, 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 just orbit. Let's go. Send them to the gate, silly me. I don't know why I'm going to the gate. I'm half asleep this morning, guys. I'm going to repair this while they destroy the gate. Oh, let's not bother. Let's get rid of these. If I remember rightly. <clears throat> right, I need these boys to take these out quickly. Right, let's burn away. Sweet, one more. They're dealt with. We'll come back to destroying the uh, Stargate when uh, it's appropriate. Typhoon, what? Uh, just that always reminds me of that off the off the film, off the Star Trek film. Oh, in fact, I think it was the Star Trek series, the original. Jesus. There's a ship like this with a big open hole as a mouth, like a mouth. Always reminded me of that, but Typhoon's good, good ship. Fitted right, with, with the right skills, yeah. Boom. OK. 
Okay, let's sort this one out. You can't believe two medium drones bringing down a battleship. I mean, normal circumstances, that would be impossible. Well, it would take it a, a lot longer. I won't say impossible, but... There we go. He's gone. Get that typhoon. Back to the... And then we'll get back to the uh, Stargate. Okay. I think I can uh, safely orbit now. Without that, and I'll repair that. He did. It's going to take a little while, this. The structure is better than the armour and the bloody shields. I noticed there's quite a few coming in to, uh, to watch, guys. And then leave in. Say hello in chat, if you can. Oh, we got another spawn. Let's get the mediums. Let's get the cruisers. Oh, no, that one. Darkana. Staying as I am right now, my signature <laughs> radius will be tiny compared to... So they will not be hitting me just yet. Well, now they are. No, let's kill him, finish him off. There we go. Okay. Get the rupture. Blimey. There's some DPS off these mothers. Some damage. Right. It's him. It'll be him. Let's have a look. The typhoons aren't hitting me for much. Dark is not that much. Oops, sorry guys, just crack the uh, microphone. Come on boys, let's finish these buggers off. Yeah, I do like the Tempest, but my favourite is the... is a Maelstrom. But it's a, really, it's a, it's a sniping, heavy gun battleship. I don't think I've seen any sort of short range setup on those. That works anyway. Right, let's get a typhoon next. to finish that gate off but uh, 
They keep spawning through, the little swines. dead well, I like that skin Do like that skin. Boom. For the spawn guys, as usual, this has become painful. <laughs> Let's do this. Before we uh, get the Hugins. We're at a decent distance now with the Gila, so uh, shouldn't bother us too much now. Just need to get these these uh, cruisers killed. Sweet. Okay. Nice one. These are going to pop very quickly. There you go. And the last one. And we'll get these two. dead <laughs> mm, they're still getting me Just a strange looking ship. Just remind me of a a whale, just mouth open. Actually that's a that's a whale shark. It looks like that. this one but watch this one die <laughs> they're trying trying their best I 
Freedom, liberty. Oh my god, there's more. Right, he's dead. I have to kill the lights. Ouch. Right, we're gonna have to kill these little buggers. Good. They die quickly. Yep, you keep on dying quickly. You'll make me a happy man. <clears throat> Trying to kill the gate, but, uh, hmm. Every time there's a spawn, And we're back to ships. <clears throat> Mainly focus on this one. There they go. Doom, doom, doom. Repping a little bit. Well, he's going to be dead soon. Boom. one I'm getting a little bit of damage Shield tanked. Yeah, these are shield tanked. Beauty about Mimita, you can go either way armor tank or shield tank. Quite versatile in that respect. And he's down. Few in on me, some are missing. It's wonderful, get another spawn. Try and kill the gate before it, if there is another one. Yeah. I think we might do this. We'll leave the big boy here. 
Let's get some DPS on the gate and let's see what happens. I can handle one battleship, no problem. Twenty-four damage, yeah, we can handle that. So I'll leave him out, so if there is another spawn coming. I'll get it to halfway damaged in structure and then kill the uh, Tempest. <clears throat> this is the only time I wish I had extra DPS. I just love that you actually get the damage on the uh, on the um, on the gate on you know on structures as well as ships. It's good. My God, the structures just. <laughs> I don't think it. Uh, I thought it'd show you a spec on it, but it never does. So we'll leave Dark Anna to uh, try and catch up with me. With the Gila, keeps them off the drone. Well, he won't be able to hit the drones anyway. Another control tower, another POS. <clears throat> right. Excuse me. Right, let's kill that Tempest and see what comes through. They're coming for you, big boy. Do your stuff. That's better. Yeah, now he's going to go down. Let's 
sweet. Let's pull them back on the gate. Boom. <laughs> right, let's just leave these to kill the gate. Look at all that salvage, guys. If you had uh, another character in a salvager, like an Optus, uh, Fuzzy as an Optus, I just can't really run too while I'm filming, recording. But it coming here, I've got four and four, so four salvagers and four tractor beams. And you can clear the field in no time, guys. If you want the fit for that notice, let me know. It just clears the field in no time. Just need to set up your overview, you know, for Rex, or have a separate overview setting. Oh, we're getting there. Now, I can't remember if we have another spawn as it blows up. I mean, they're, they're hitting it. Yeah, good DPS. It's just bloody that is a tough gate. There we go, any second now. There we have it. goes wild <laughs> right guys let's go back drones are in ship's okay we can knock those off now so took a while in the gila as you can imagine the Tengu would have been ideally suited for that mission. Okay. Docking permission requested. Docking request accepted. Where's my money, bitch? <laughs> uh, okay. So, 631,000 loyalty points. That's um, finally done. That's a long mission. Well, it's in five sections. Um, 
thank you guys for watching i think that's it for right now i might be on later uh thanks chris for joining us on chat um i don't know if you heard you must have heard me mate but you, you didn't reply you might be in afk i don't know if you can talk to me or not when you're at work if you are at work but um thanks very much if you like what you see subscribe and like and i do appreciate it it's it's much uh, appreciated guys it does a lot for the channel obviously it's a new channel it's growing and and i'll stick with it and just keep pushing out more more content but thank you very much have a great day and i'll see you later on i might be doing some more level four missions either in the new scorpion uh or the uh, navy raven Okay, see you later, guys.